But uh, um, and to my surprise, Mako was there, wasn't she? Watching from the uh, from the gallery, from the VIP balcony. Um, I did have a, a brief conversation with her after the show, and I know you did as well. Uh, she told me that her favourite match was the cage match, but uh, uh, you had a little bit of a reconnection, bit of interaction with Mako. Was it good to catch up? It was. It was. She's so funny. <clears throat> I think, as I said, now over the years, I've got to know her personality because when I first started going to Japan, she didn't speak much English. And obviously I spoke no Japanese. And it was just funny sometimes the miscommunication. Like There's a, there's so many stories where we thought, like me and Charlie once thought we were going to, the, the hot springs was in the translator. Hot springs, no idea what that is. And it was like a naked swimming bath. <laughs> You know, like little moments like that, and it's like, yeah. oh, my God, here we go. But now, obviously, I can actually have a conversation with her, and she is my friend, and she's actually so funny. Yeah, and, and you, 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 you mentioned would... going over to Japan at 18, but I think would your first interaction with Mako, would that have been over uh, in Germany, maybe that same year, 2018, for WXW? And, and I think you wrestled Mako uh, over in Germany. Would that have been your first match, maybe your first interaction, or one of your first interactions with Mako back then? The, the first interaction I had with her is she used to come, I don't know, Again, whether she was on the Fight Club show, but she was over in Wolverhampton for a, a period of time and she used to come and watch training and take training sometimes. And she pulled my coach aside and said that she saw something in me and asked me if I wanted to go to Japan. I think I did the first tour for two weeks and then I wrestled her in Germany. And then I, I swear I wrestled her in Germany. Then I ended up wrestling her in Japan, in the UK, all over I had a few matches with her so I'm so lucky to get to do that because she's just an incredible person inside and outside the ring yeah absolutely and uh, uh you mentioned one of your first tours and I've got some pictures here from some of your early tours um and I think that was possibly one of your early tours when you uh embraced uh, Mako but uh, winning the Sendai Girls Junior Championship back in 2018. Now we're talking probably getting on for six years ago now, and you would have been what 18 years old. Um, and uh, there you are, fantastic looking bout. And of course, I think on your second tour 2019, winning the tag titles alongside Charlie Evans, um, the Medusa Complex. Uh, some fantastic pictures there, some good memories. Uh, well, I say some good memories, uh, they, they must be good memories. Bring that fond memories for you. Yeah, it was such a a lovely, lovely time in my life. And being in Japan is incredible. Like to be able to do that at the age I was, I'll always be grateful for that opportunity. But to be able to do it with someone that's one of your best friends, it was just so funny. Like, and it just Evie, Charlie, sorry, I should say, sorry, Charlie, um, <laughs> he's just a role model to me inside and outside the ring again. I think she's an incredible person and I look up to her in so many ways. I just think she's spending that time with her made me grow as a person, just like idolising her really. It was just incredible. We had lots of nice vegan food as well, which was nice in Japan, which I didn't even think had vegan food at the time. So yeah, it was great. That's really awesome. And uh, like I say, you was out there 2018, 2019, uh, but then you, you didn't return to Japan until three years later, 2022. I think you was back out there next. Um, you must have missed the country. Was, was it nice to go back after that long absence? It was. It was because now it is like a home away from home. It really is. So it was so nice to see all the girls. And like there was a there's a little, I say little young girl. She's probably, well, I think, how old is she now? I think she's like 17. Her name's Manami. And I've seen her grow up every time I've gone, bless her. And she's a young lady now, I should say. And it's just mad to see these people grow up and they become friends. And like they are like a, my family over there. And I do really miss them. I do. But hopefully yeah. that's it. Let, let me ask you then, you've been out there a good handful of times uh, from 2018 through to 20, uh, 23. Um, how is your Japanese? Have you, have you kind of taken lessons or do you just, is it, is it not pidgin English, but pidgin Japanese, just uh, certain words here and there? How is your Japanese and uh, your, your love for the culture? I love the culture. I love the food. I love everything about it. I think it's so respectful. I think the past few tours I've done, I've picked up the language more and more. And I tell you, people may knock this, but I think the best place to learn the language is in the pub in Japan because people will speak to you. 
people always speak to you and I'll <clears> like, try and speak to them. And obviously they, they speak a little bit of English normally. So you have enough to get a conversation with them. And there's a pub that I always go to that does the best Guinness. If you like Guinness, oh, it's called The Swan and it's in Sendai. And the, the owner of the pub put in the translator, there's so many things that I want to say to you, but I, I can't, I don't know how. And that really upset me. So me and my friend, um, we made sure that when we went back there, we would learn a little bit, just enough to be able to have a conversation with him. So that was that was nice. But I know enough to get by. I can order myself a drink and food, you know, the important stuff and yeah. all the light, light phrases. But that's, that's all I know, really. There we go. So if you want to learn a language, the best place to go is the pub. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Absolutely 